something thank you for supporting me and i tell you i got some shout outs i tell you my, my page is growing i have met so many great people so let's say prayers right now lord 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 there is power in your name forgive us of the sins we've committed against you by any word need or thought allow us another chance to get it right to do it right let this food be nourishment to my beautiful and healthy body and have your way in our lives. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen and amen. Y'all, look what I got. I think my, my bowl is, okay, we're going to do this. My bowl is hiding my other sausage. I tried to do a, a good, uh, I probably I got to bring it back. Oh, oh yeah, y'all was missing all them shrimp, huh? Mm. All right, y'all, let's sip. Let's see what we're going to toast um, for all my new relationships and y'all new relationships. The monetized people who was monetized, congratulations to you all. It is all good. This platform is for all of us. So let's support each and every one of us. So, salut, salut, sip, sip the good food stuff. Yum, yum. Yeah, give me some. That's good. Let me tell you what we eating. Let me see if I'm going to get this out the way because I would hate to knock that one down. Look. So, we're eating some garlic shrimp. We're also uh, eating some sticky rice. You know, the sticky rice is that elephant rice that I did a long time ago. You have to let it soak between two to six hours. Uh, that's how sticky it will be. Um, so, yeah, and I have a dipping sauce that I do for it. It's a Thai dipping sauce because, you know, the this is from the Thai family. And um, can y'all see it? And uh, the way that I make it, y'all, wait a minute, my, my napkin fell somewhere. The way that I, I do the Thai uh, dipping sauce for the sticky rice is a half a cup of sugar, a half a cup of um, garlic flavor rice vinegar. I chop up maybe seven garlic cloves fresh. I do some pepper flakes and then a fourth of a, of, of a teaspoon of uh, uh, salt and, of course, my Greek seasoning. And I get my uh, mortar and I mash it down to it's like paste. So when my um, vinegar and sugar dissolves, the sugar dissolves, I let it just, I pour in that mixture and just let it simmer for maybe a couple of minutes. And so that's how I get that sauce for the sticky rice. So, let's dig in, y'all. Um, I'm. I was on live uh, with a couple of people today, and <laughs> my faves. <laughs> I don't wanna. You know what? I got some. I got some leftover B loves. Oh, I got the hiccups, y'all. I got some uh, leftover B love sauce. I should have did this for the shrimp, but because I don't wanna put that in that vinegar. Oh, y'all. That's tender. Mmm. Mmm. I'm talking. My God, that's good. Wait a minute. Oh. Take the first bite. There you go. Yum, yum. Give me some. I really think mm, that bee love sauce will be kicking with this. Y'all, these are the sauces that I get from the um, fish market. Not the fish market. The meat market. By my mother's house. Mm -hmm. It's fresh. They make it themselves. Mm -hmm. And the flavor is wonderful. But y'all, I was on a couple of lives. Um, Canter Giles, that's my girl. She always blow me up every time I get on. And I was, um, 
I'm talking about the S's. Live today. Today. Coco, tell them. How can I forget? That's my girl. Coco, tell them. Mm-hmm. Ooh, that's hot. And it's still, y'all, you know how we know how, you know what, I'm sorry, y'all. I love sticky rice because you can play with it. Remember when your mama said, don't you play with your food? Mm-hmm. Like this. Mm hmm. That sauce is so good. Um, I met a lot of people today, so I'm gonna have some shout outs at the end. Oh my god, this is it. And it's a little spicy with the red pepper plate. But that, um, that Greek seasoning is good. Mm hmm. Mm, that rice is the bomb. You can find it at, um, at some Asian stores. I, 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 um, I order mine online. That's so good. Um, but I met so many good people. I had a co-worker that called me today because, you know, we was talking about my YouTube page. She said, your personality is so big. You're not, you don't, you're not going to like, everybody's not going to like you like I said before. She said, Somebody would be threatened because your personality is big and you you are you are who you are. She said, Hood, you are who you are. So don't worry about if you lose some of your um subscribers. Because when one go away, you're gonna have 10 more. And that's what happened today, y'all. She spoke it, and my son did too. I try not to let this YouTube page take me down because I already know. And I know it, y'all. But we're still humans. I know one thing. That hood girl, too. I'm not going nowhere, y'all. Mm -mm. I'm meeting too many beautiful people. And it's for a reason. So, yeah. Do y'all like that skin on the sausage? Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. Oh. So, Forgive me if I eat it off. I don't really like all that skin. So, today I was feeling some type of way earlier. And so, those two calls really did speak to me and speak over me as well. So, I got to call y'all out. Rachel Giles, you my girl. Thank you for calling me today. God already knew what I needed to hear. So thank you. And my son, David, that y'all met. Thank you, my love, for lifting up your mama today. Thank you. This is good. Mm-mm. You know what? And to, and to use that, that vinegar in the backdrop, you can taste the vinegar, but the sugar in them. The red pepper and the garlic and the Greek sauce and the salt, it just, everything just so mellow. It's really good. I make it all the time, y'all. So, today, you know, yesterday I didn't have a chance to uh, see uh, Kobe's and his daughter's thing, but uh, it was on YouTube today and so I clicked on it and my tears, y'all. So if I have a little black around my eyes, trust me, that was shit. Because I, I just cut it down now, but I, I paused it. Man, I pray for all of them. That was on the helicopter, my God. We don't know when, we don't know how, we don't know where we're going to go. But it's all planned, you know. But it's, it'll make it even easier. My prayers for all of them continually. Mm-hmm. We got to always stay in prayer, y'all, for everybody. We don't. We can't do selfish prayers for us and our family. Not that we don't pray for our family, but. 
There's so many other people that need to be lifted up. And y'all know the Bible says about two or more joined together, touching and agreeing on the same. God says, there I am in the midst. So I'm hoping we are all still praying for Kobe Bryant's family, his wife, his daughters, all the other people that was on that helicopter. I'm still praying for my friend Yolanda's son, uh, who has a, a great illness. You know, we we ne we ne we never we we. Mm. Okay, look here, y'all. I'm gonna ask y'all something. And it's a hard question. Do your family, because some things, things are just tragic, and then some people you know is is suspected. Do you have your house in order? If you don't do it, it's never too soon. Get your house in order. So, y'all, somebody that was on... Kendra Giles side, they're going to be doing a live in somewhere. One day, I want to go to somebody who have they meet and greet. You know, I'm new, so I don't know how many subscribers should you have to do a meet and greet, but I want to join a meet and greet, though, so I can introduce myself. And I know that some of the people that will be there, they're going to know that, that name, that hood girl, too. That name is, you know, it's not, it's not the same with everybody. So, they yeah, remember that. And maybe if they see my face, hear my voice, uh, then hopefully they'll know um, it's me. <laughs> and I'm a hugger. And I'm a high fiver as well. So get ready, y'all. When y'all meet me, gonna be a lot of touching. Mm-hmm. Mm. Y'all, my dinner is so good tonight. Mm-hmm. My mother called me. She said, one of these I saw you and David do that um hot dog because I posted it on Facebook, right? Um I said, Yeah, mom, we did. She said, but you was doing another when you was eating some shrimp and you didn't even clean them. <laughs> hey, mother. When I go to the fresh market, I always get four pounds of shrimp because I break them down by pound because everybody knows that there is at least 20 to 21 ship, uh, shrimp in each pound. So I come home and I break mine down because it's only me. Like, this is 20 shrimp. I won't eat them all. No, because look at all them over there. I, I'm just eating these back here. So, I say, Mother, I buy my shrimp, beheaded, or deheaded, or how you want to say it, and deveined. I say, so when I bring them home, they get a good bath. But they are already deveined, and the head is cut off. So, she said, well... I saw you pulling that stuff off. Mama, that's just the skin that we have right under the bottom. You want the flavor to stay in, honey. Say, so, oh. She's a handful of them. <laughs> and she is so clean. And nobody can go in my mother's kitchen but me. She want me to fix everybody's food. I'm like, okay, I'm, I'm, I'll let everybody know I'm getting there at a certain time. If you don't get there when I'm fixing my food that I can fix y'all's, if I'm eating when y'all come in, y'all just gonna have to wait till I get through because I ain't eating no cold food and I ain't finna keep eating up my food. I'm like, mama, why? Because when I know you clean. Well, mama, there are other people clean. Your other sons and daughters are clean. I ain't the only one that got a lot of butter right there. I want some more dryer because I can make it in a ball. A ball, 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 ball. Mm-hmm. 
down. I tell you, my birthday is coming next Tuesday, right? I don't have a clue. So, I was talking with my oldest son again. My middle son, I really don't care. So, I said, you know what? I live down here by all this water. Hotels everywhere. Yeah, I do live close. And so, so I'm thinking, if I haven't scheduled anything now, and I don't have peace about it, that means I'm not supposed to do it. Because I don't have peace about flying or going anywhere, driving anywhere. So I said, well, I'm down here by all the water. Why I can't just get a hotel up the street away from the house and just be gone for a night or two? Mm-hmm. And wake up with that water view. Mm-hmm. In my hotel room. So I think that's what I'm going to do. Mm-hmm. Because I live by all this water, y'all. I'm in the, all but the open gulf. The gulf. The gulf. I love you see it. I'm right here. Five minutes of the water. So why should I get a ticket or a plane ticket or drive five and six hours to water when I'm already buy water? Does that make sense to y'all? Mm-hmm. Tell me, y'all. What does y'all do? Mm-hmm. Because if I can save a couple of hundred dollars, hmm, I'm down with saving now. We're saving a hundred dollars now. When I get to the big six zero, Oh, yeah, no holes barred on that one, baby. God spent my life for the next three. Well, I'm tell you how old I am right now. <laughs> when I turn that big 60, I'm going to have a what to do. You hear me? And I know I'm going to have so many YouTube friends. It's going to be huge. Mm-hmm. So I hope everybody would attend when that time comes. So, look, y'all, I got some shout-outs. Oh, you know what? I haven't said this in a long time. All my new people who was on here today, that you heard about me or somebody shared me, before you leave, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, that notification bell right on the side, ding down, ding down. Don't forget to give me the thumbs up if you like my video. Don't forget to comment, share, and like. But 